Yeah, we smoked some moose recently. Marcel might still have some. Unless he gave it away. I know I gave all mine away. I just fasted over here for four days, four nights. No food, no water. My, just looking for my own medicines, you know, for my own life. Trying to find center. My little fasting huts over there. You can see it from here. And uh, got a couple of guys to watch the fire for four days, four nights. That's my my lifeline. My name is Marcel Gagnon. Um, I'm from the Beaver Clan and from Tately Tene, Juno nominated musician. And, uh, it was a good journey in music, but it's taken me to this place now where I feel like the work that I'm doing is more fulfilling than pursuing that other journey of music. These songs, ancient songs that have been passed down and passed down, now they're being revived. So music to me has taken on a whole different form now and a different meaning because it's coming from a place so old and so deep within. And it awakens everything about you as, an, as a person. Spiritually, um, in the, the broader picture, the bigger picture of things, um, I'm witness to uh, huge changes right now. I don't know if it's changes or if it's the awakening of um, our spiritual selves as Aboriginal people. That's what I like to think of it as being more than anything. I think um, that it's it's meant to be that way, and it should be that way. That other other uh, forms didn't really work for us. And so to get back to our ancient ways, and if it's a reinvention of those old ceremonies, that's fine too. But there's something about nature and being attached to it that is very spiritual. And I think that's what this place represents, and, and it, it's it's. Uh, it's really encouraging to to actually feel like you're part of that change. The, the ceremonies and the visions and the dreams and people, other people's ideas, all come together in the same format as a song. And the mountain disappears and then it comes back. A lot of the stuff that we've been chatting about here is pretty, uh, I don't know, serious, sacred, without laughter and everything. But that's not, that's not really the case. There's a lot of laughter in my life. I, I kill myself sometimes when I hear a really good joke and everything. Ask me if I'm happy. I am just totally happy and at peace. I love to love. I still feel that, that desire once in a while to get back out there and do it. But not to stand there and sing my lungs off the strum my guitar. There's going to be more and more to it than that. 
It's more about being able to interact with people again. I feel like I'm three quarters of the way up the mountain. You know, in my in my life's journey, I feel like I'm just about at the top now and I think when I do reach the top, it will be time to, to sit down and rest and look back and look down at everything and go, that was a really, really interesting journey I went on. That's what I think it, it's going to become. <laughs> My employer. Activators, Dave Trapeni said to me, you know that mountain, Marcel, that's going to be your legacy. Not the music. And he kind of caught me off guard when he said that. He said the uh, mountain will be your legacy. And as I thought about it more, I totally agree with Dave that it probably is, because this has meaning. Not that music doesn't have meaning. Uh, music is going to be there forever but this has been here forever this will be here after all of us are gone this is maybe what it's all about now. I, I don't know and if it is wow am I the lucky guy am I the blessed one That prayer tree, there was 103 little prayer ties on that tree. You could reach the top and we started putting them on. I went to the Prince George jail and we did have original day and we get the guys to do up little ties of their hopes and their dreams and we brought them all up here and put them on that tree. And from that the tree began to grow. This year, all the ties on it came from from uh, people who have been coming up here faithfully from all over Canada, actually. It's a powerful, powerful tree. We call it a prayer tree. Prayer tree as opposed to pear tree. 